All right, now I'm here at the Cinema Makeup School booth. I'm here with Lee. How's it going today? Good, James. How you doing? I'm doing really good. So tell us about the makeup and uh, everything you guys have going on here at the school in the booth. Sure. I'm with Cinema Makeup School. We're out of Los Angeles, California. Uh, I'm just here sculpting a little bit, showing the attendees a little bit about what we do with uh, creature maquette design. Um, we teach everything from beauty to body painting to airbrushing. But here at Comic-Con, we like to bring our monsters and our superheroes and our villains. So every day we're doing multiple demonstrations showing how we use prosthetics and special makeup effects. And uh, we have our students in the booth. We have all our family and friends come by and help out, and it's a lot of fun. Now, you mentioned that you did some makeup earlier, and you have some people walking around. Tell us about that. Well, today we have uh, one of our graduates, uh, uh, Jose uh, Davalos, and he is creating a uh, Ursula from Little Mermaid cosplay. I don't know if you got a chance to see it, but it was incredible. Uh, and then we also have um, uh, Hellboy from the, uh, the uh, new video game they have out. Not the film, but the video game, uh, the fighting game. And then we also have a partnership with Sideshow Collectibles. We're doing their character Cleopsis. I'm one of the directors of Cinema Makeup School, but one of our other directors is V. Neal, three-time Academy Award-winning makeup artist from Beetlejuice and Lost Boys and Edward Scissorhands. So we collaborated, uh, and tomorrow we'll be doing Cleopsis all day. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun, a lot of work, and uh, I'm excited to be here, but I'm also looking forward to Monday when I can get some sleep. Yeah, that's always the Comic-Con thing, rest afterwards. Now, for those that are interested in a makeup career, uh, tell us about your school and, and what they can expect going through the process. Right. Uh, well, we, this is our 25th year. Uh, we're licensed through the state of California and the United States. We also do international student visas, veterans benefits. Our classes go from one week to as long as eight months, and we go every day, all day, Monday through Friday. Uh, we'll train in everything from ZBrush to creature design to beauty to special effects to blood rigging. We even have a severed head class. We partner with working special effects studios and we work with uh, Academy Award winning and Emmy Award winning graduates as well as instructors. Um, it's a lot of work but we're very passionate and we love what we do and we uh, only want students that want to really take what they love as a hobby, say cosplay, and turn it into something they can make money with. Nice, nice. And for those that are interested in the school, um, does your school supply, um, you know, hook people up with in internships, connections, on yep. studios to kind of work their way up? Oh yeah, exactly. In fact, because we are a vocational school, we focus on work. They're not learning things that aren't going to help them in this industry. Uh, I've been working out here in Hollywood since 1994. I worked on last big film with Star Trek Beyond. I worked on Godzilla. Uh, I've done a lot of work with Disney, Nickelodeon, Slipknot, Alice Cooper. Um, all of our instructors work in the industry, so we focus on the work element. They learn how to break down a script, how to bid on a project. They start getting the job email every day their second week in school, and we hope they can work in the evenings and weekends while they're in school. They have access to our facilities after they graduate for years to come and practice. We train them how to get into the union. We train them how to work with agencies. And uh, if you don't go out and put into practice what you learn, you can't turn your hobby into a career. So that's the focus. Learn how to do it, but realize it does not take talent to do this. It takes passion, work ethic, skill, which comes from practice, and volume. Just do the jobs over and over and over. All right, Lee, so tell us a little bit about what you're working on. Well, this is called a creature maquette sculpture, and what this is is an oil-based clay, and this helps the director get a physical idea of what we're trying to translate. I mean, how can I describe that in words? Well, it's a vampire samurai. Uh, let me show you, okay? So this is a class we teach at Cinema Makeup School. Uh, we also teach this in digital form with ZBrush, uh, and then they would learn how to take this from conception to life casting, to sculpting, to full creation, application, removal. We do it all. You know, and that's important for their portfolio to show the whole step of the process. We're going to train uh, the kids how to uh, get the requirements for union membership, which is a local 706 in Los Angeles County, if they can work here and they stay here. Union's great because you get health insurance, benefits, retirement, 401k. A lot of people don't think we have a career path doing stuff like this. I mean, I make monsters for a living, you know? How awesome is that? Uh, and then we're going to train them about agencies and all the business aspect of working on set and navigating the career path. So tell us about the kind of passion that students ha uh, have to have or you like to see in them. Oh yeah. Well, I knew I wanted to do this when I was 10 years old. 
1980, growing up in Alabama, I snuck into the movie theater and saw Friday the 13th. And I said, that's a thing? You can do that? And then I never stopped. So it's not about talent. That's what scares people away. The only thing that separates me from everyone else who wants to be in Hollywood doing this is I just did it. I put my body out here and then I applied for jobs and I kept doing it and I never gave up. You don't take no for an answer. You fail miserably. You learn from that. You show up again. You realize you're going to be fine. It's about just doing the jobs, having the, the passion, having the dedication, showing up, getting along with others, playing well with others, anticipating what production needs, and realizing it's a team effort, it's not about you. And then calling them back, staying in touch, going to the events, giving other people jobs so they will then refer you, and it becomes a lifelong thing you do. I don't do this eight hours a day, I do it 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We all do, and we do it because we love it. No, I think this is completely awesome. It's always good to see a career path. And for those students that are interested, or anybody that's interested in your school, where can they go to find out more well, about it? They can go to cinemamakeup.com. They can look for us at Cinema Makeup School on Instagram and Facebook and YouTube. We've got a lot of tutorial videos and a lot of seminars. You know, just, just look for us. We're there. 25 years, baby. We're not going away. Awesome, man. I love the passion. Thanks. I love the education. I love what you're doing for people. So thanks a lot, man. I really right. appreciate it. Awesome displays. You, yeah, I, I don't want to be too scared walking around here with, you, with your makeup. So well, take thanks. Care and have fun. Thanks, Lee. Appreciate it.